Hi there, in this video we're going to go through investigation number two on parallel resistors. And once again, this is an investigation based on an every circuit app circuit. So make sure that you've got the activity sheet downloaded and in front of you, and that you also have the every circuit app uh, open on your mobile device or in a Chrome browser on your desktop or laptop device. In this case, we want to go to the community space and search for the circuit called NOC Parallel Resistors 2. So I've got the Every Circuit uh, app open in a Chrome browser on my desktop device, and I'm going to go to the community space and search for NOC underscore Parallel Resistors 2. And the circuit pops up as normal. We click on its icon to open up the circuit. And you should remember, if you remember from the last video, that this is exactly the same circuit as before. We have a 12 voltage, uh, sorry, 12 volt power source, a voltage source. We've got three resistors connected in parallel, one kilo ohm, 250 ohms, 250 ohms. And the total circuit current is also 108 milliamps. The only difference is, sorry, that we can see is we've connected voltmeters across each of the uh, resistors. First question in the worksheet asks us, what is the voltage across each of the resistors? Well, we can quite clearly see here. The voltage across the first resistor is 12 volts. There it is, and it's the same as the supply voltage. The voltage across the second resistor is 12 volts, because it's the same as the supply voltage. And the voltage across the third resistor is also 12 volts, the same as the supply voltage. Now, this is different to a series circuit. Remember in series circuits, the, where there was a voltage drop across each component, each uh, resistor in that series circuit. Um, and the total voltage was equal to the total drops around the circuit. In this case, that's completely different. Uh, it looks like the voltage across each of the resistors in parallel is exactly the same as the source voltage. In other words, each of these resistors sees the same voltage. They all see the full voltage of the battery. And what do you notice about the total voltages across the resistors? Well, we've, we've, had a, we've mentioned that already. Um, they're all the same. All of the voltages are the same and they are all equal to the voltage of the power source, in this case, the 12-volt battery. 